Testing, testing, one, two, three. Mic, 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 mic. Hey guys, what's up? Today, I am going to do a highly requested video. Yay! Don't know why I said it like that. But yeah. So after I did my why I hate my loft bed video, a lot of people were requesting that I do a why I love my loft bed video, which is a little weird because, I mean, it's mostly obvious reasons why I love my loft bed, and I kind of mentioned some of those reasons in the why I hate my loft bed video, so it kind of confuses me why they want that video too, but, I mean, whatever, if you guys want it, hi. Anyway, let's get on with the video. So the first one is first. <laughs> the first one is really obvious, and it's just that I have more space in my room to walk around. Because before, when I had my bed on my floor, it was hard to get around. The next one is also pretty obvious too, and that is that I have a desk now. Um, before, I wasn't able to put a desk in my room because there was no floor space. <laughs> There's barely enough space for me to walk. So now I can have more space with a desk. So, just a win-win. The next one is that it's harder for my parents to wake me up in the morning. They have to get more creative when it comes to trying to get me up. They can't just be like, Jada, let him wake up. Jayla wake up and then eventually I wake up like they have to really try to get up to my bed and wake me up I'm a really heavy sleeper Jay wake up Jay get up The next one is that I can hide from my cousins or whoever when my family comes over which is fun because I have a lot of younger cousins and sometimes, a lot of the time, they drive me crazy. So I can just go up there and the rule is that when they come over my house, they're not allowed to go onto my bed. So it works out nicely. My bad cousin for saying that? Yeah, probably. The next one is that I don't have to make my bed. I mean, my parents could make me make my bed, make me make my bed, but they don't because it's hard to make my bed in the morning. Plus, no one comes over. If you were to come into my room, you wouldn't notice it. Like, cause I, I fold my blankets sometimes, but you wouldn't like go up and realize that like my sheets are wrinkled or that my bed doesn't look perfect. So it works out nicely. Done. Next one is that I can have many dance parties up there by myself and no one else is invited. An amazing one is that when people come over I can laugh when they hit their head or when they trip or whenever they do something funny. <laughs> but if you want to go see people hit their head and trip, go watch the other video. Hey mom, can you pass me the sharpener? The last really good one is that people won't sit on my bed when they come over. I don't know, I don't really like when people sit on my bed and then they mess it up and I spend all that time making it, you know? Jay, can I sit on your bed? Ah, no! Focus on me. Okay guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please comment down below what you would like to see on my channel from now on. And also, subscribe to my channel because I would appreciate that very much. I am so close to 200. I think there's like nine more. Ten or nine or ten more before I get to 100. And I'm just like freaking out. To, wait, did I say to 100? I meant to 200. Thank you guys so much for supporting me and subscribing and commenting and giving me video requests finally because everyone was just dead in the comments section. There was like nothing there. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys. So I'd just be walking through and I'd get scared because I'd think that one of them saw me but then they didn't. And then at one point only one of them could see me and he was trying to get me so I would run away. Run away.